I'm here at 10305 First Avenue, built in 1954, and it includes the planting out front, as well as the edible garden. It has blueberries, plums, and some of the other veggies. This includes a little um, fire pit when you take that cover off, and Ragosa roses that have rose hips, which are also edible. And this year, we got to put in, in the spring, the crepe myrtles, which have started to flower. Pretty awesome. And some of the uh, Shasta daisies. I'll come around this side just so you get the nice bright color. It looks pretty awesome. Okay, we're running the solar next week and we have with the bicycles, zero emissions, including the car. It is gonna plug in right over here. So we will truly be net zero with even transportation. Here's the surfboard rack that I built a few years ago. Plus the surf kayak, all available for friends and guests. Barbecue grill covered up nicely. It's the new stainless steel grill. And of course the Yeti keeps things cold. I built this table also a few years ago. I was about, I don't know, four or 500 pounds. Sanded and finished that. Outdoor seating with another fire pit. And that little remote control, the white one, ties into the ceiling fan in this party pavilion. Outdoor seating there, cornhole, ping pong, and second half of ping pong, second half of cornhole. And then in here we have the fifth bedroom is the guest cottage. Pretty nice in here. I'm gonna straighten this up a little bit there. So it sits nice. And this includes a bed, air conditioning, wiring for the flat screen TV, complete with the Wi-Fi and the Netflix. And then we got a little friend, this little plant we're leaving in there just to see how big it grows. Kind of interesting. Shut this door. It'll wind around here to the bike paddock. And the bike paddock is awesome because it includes the, um, it's, it's salvaged six by sixes that I use to create these um, bike racks and you don't need to have a kickstand. Lots of bikes. We like to bike boogie boards. And then over here, this is the um, the place where I can put my uh, drink on the way to the beach. And this holds all the beach chairs, so you don't have to lean down on the floor. You can just pick it up right here. Play bin has all the goodies in it. Back to the planting. And then when we need it, we have the rain collection from the gutters. And that's the rain barrel. So all in, pretty awesome little spot. I usually come in this door from the beach and this is the final shot just as we approach for having parties. Pretty awesome little place here in Stone Harbor, New Jersey.